You got sloppy pain. You screwed up. It's unacceptable that she's dead. You can do better. I played it as business as usual. But everything had changed the moment those elevator doors opened to reveal Mona. Annie Finn was a licensed gunsmith, licensed dealer in firearms. Right. The property owned by Vladimir Lem. Three groups. One, DOAs who had connections to Russian OC. Identified as Finn's employees. Two, the Mafia. And three, the clowns wearing the cleaning company jumpsuits. They mentioned a name. Kaufman. This one's evil. It has only started. I don't like it. I don't like it a bit. It's yours, Payne. It makes no sense. For you, Winterson, homicide. Sebastian Gate. It's gonna be all over the news. The Senator? Winterson was the ideal. What the job was all about. Someone to look up to. Bravora knew it, too. We got lucky. There's an eyewitness. She hovered over my shoulder, whispering warnings. I didn't want to listen. Mona was the suspect in Winterson's case. I didn't tell them I had seen her. I wanted to stall. Maybe it was because she was alive when everyone else kept dying on me. Survivor's guilt washed away. Detective Winterson's phone. Give me that. Your boyfriend. The computer search on the squeaky cleaning company and Kaufman had come up empty. I needed to talk to Vlad, get his version, be the bearer of bad news on Annie Finn. Vlad had bought the old Ragnarok nightclub. He was renovating it into a trendy restaurant, vodka. Mona's appearance had triggered a dislocation, schizophrenia. I felt elation, but with it, fear that all the past evils had come along for the ride. Max, 911. Bad guys with big guns. They've got me pinned down on the entrance hall. Could use some help. Could use it now. I had to find another way to reach Vlad. No time to call backup. My case had a life of its own. I got in through the back door. Memories of my previous visit here lurked. Someone was talking on the other line. Nothing to worry about, baby. I'm going to be all right. When haven't I been all right? Max is here now. You know Max. I'll call you when it's over. I love you, baby. Vlad was a perfect gentleman, reassuring his girlfriend. Someone other than Annie. Lad, shut up and stay alive. I'm coming. Max, you heard him. He's coming for you. <laughs> Max, these wise guys are really lousy shots. You should have no trouble taking them. You're Max Penn. Afraid so. Max, I'm Mike, Vladimir's friend. You are the sheriff. Uh, how about making me your deputy? 
Let's go bail out your boss before he talks us all to death. Let's ride! They asked for it. Just follow the trail. Very good show. Very funny. Baseball Jones bat. Baseball bat Jesus boy. Christ, Apocalypse now. Got some heavy Captain shit baseball here. Baseball bat boy's girlfriend. Yeah, she's not my... Hey, <laughs> Winterson would have found a way to do this nice, neat, and clean. Logic told me backup should be on its way. Someone must have heard the gunfire. Logic was such a liar. Teeth, the whole set for a two. Shit. We'll get there. Up the stairs. Vlad wouldn't be able to hold on much longer, if it wasn't too late already. Damn. 
is embarrassing, Vinny. Did you teach them to shoot? Kill him! Fucking kill him! We're coming, boss! Give up, Vinny! They're coming to take you away! Can you hear them? Shut up! Shut up! Come on, Vinny! You're not really cut out for this! Even trying. Hang on, Vlad. Max, I'm coming. Oh, no pain, not him. Fuck, fuck, fuck. What are you waiting for? Circle around and kill him. Kill the cop. The way your hands are shaking, you couldn't hit a truck! Shut up! Shut up and die, Russian! Russian, you fucking pay! My hero! You saved my life! I could kiss you! Vinny Gogniti, a criminal mastermind? He is wiping out everyone he sees as competition on the black market gun trade. The Mafia underboss has made a deal with someone powerful. <laughs> What was it you did for a living again? Scout's honor, detective. I have mended my ways, evolved to a higher level. Vodka will be the best restaurant in the city. I'll be rich and famous. Annie was a princess. They killed her for no reason. You hurt your hand just now? <laughs> a hot date yesterday. Can I tempt you? Let's pretend I'm on duty. <laughs> <laughs> 